ready room aboard a carrier of the Seventh Fleet. Both pilots and newsmen are briefed before another raid is begun on industrial centers in North Vietnam. Prop-driven Sky Raiders are in the van of the force from the carriers. They are to join with Air Force jets to hit munition dumps just 100 miles south of the red capital of Hanoi. This is the farthest north U.S. planes have struck so far. Bombs ranging up to 750 pounds are loaded aboard the planes. The raids are designed to cut off supplies from the north to the Viet Cong rebels in the south. The U.S. is relying on its intelligence reports, which estimate that 80 to 90 percent of the rebel supplies come from North Vietnam and Red China. One after another, the planes take to the air for the red targets. This proved to be one of the most successful of the U.S. air raids. One plane was lost about 60 miles from its carrier on a return flight. Washington says the raids will continue until the Reds realize it is time to talk peace. <laughs>